<clears throat> okay, hello everybody, and welcome. I know that <clears throat> was pretty fake, but okay. So, what you're going to want to do to make, you know, your melee weapon, uh, the only thing it doesn't work with is your weapon butt. So, like, you know, here, when you melee somebody with your weapon butt, that's the only thing you can't make your um, melee weapon into your gun to. So, what you're going to want to do is sprint, right? Sprint melee and then like a few like a few milliseconds after you melee here I'll just sh show you after you melee it should okay so sprint melee and then jump so here I'll just show you again for example so you sprint melee and jump almost at the same time but a bit of delay because you don't want to just go you don't want to push it at the same time so you want to sprint me weapon and then like a bit after okay it's really confusing but so sprint melee then jump but n don't push it at the same time so it's like okay I have a good idea how to explain this so when you're sprinting and then you melee so just have your whatever hand or leg I don't know but um <laughs> just have whatever you play with on the left you know, with your controller. So, you know, on the left joystick. It's, you know, to sprint. And then also have your right hand, I mean, right thumb or whatever you play with, on the right joystick. And then, while you're, once you sprint, melee, and then like, you jump the fastest your thumb or whatever you play with on the right joystick can get to the X. So, Yep, just not at the same time. Okay. So I'm going to show you every melee weapon with it. When I mean every melee weapon, I mean every melee weapon. Except for um, the weapon butt. The melee weapon I was using was fists, which makes your gun invisible. But you can't use the weapon butt to make your gun invisible, or at least I think. I mean, or whatever. Okay, so the thing I just showed you was the fists, and we're going to go on with this. The 50, 50 Blessings Briefcase. Now I'll show you what this does, and you're, you're like, oh, this is really inconvenient because you can't cut it. Yeah, because you can't make videos. So, same thing as last time. Sprint, melee, and jump as fast as you can get to the X button. And this is your gun now. A briefcase. And you can reload it. But the only thing that disables this glitch is this. Oh wait a second. Hold up. Not that. I don't I'm not sure with interacting, but throwing anything usually disables this um glitch, but it just seems like it respawned the weapon back. Hold up. Okay, so this one cannot be um undone. Actually, Yes, I can with the melee. But yeah, pistol. And then you throw. And the p pistol comes back. And for some reason, it's supposed to, like, disable when you, um... S wait, give me a second. Yeah, it's supposed to disable when you switch. So I'm going to test something. Mm-hmm. And then you go to the other weapon. And it goes back... Okay. So it seems like the... 50 blessings briefcase is not is I'm not sure if it's the only one that can be able to do that without disabling by switching or throwing or interacting so let's move on with the this knife U R S A knife to be exact or X knife knifey I don't know X knifey, sounds like an anime word. Anyways, let's try it out, and I'll show you it on both versions if I don't forget. Okay, so the pistol, this, mm -hmm. and yeah, see it disables for some of them. Okay, maybe not. Wait, 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 wait. Hold up, hold up. Oh, this one doesn't disable either. Wait, does it disable if I melee? Okay, yeah, yeah, it does. What if... 
I throw a grenade down. Nope, doesn't disable that. What if I interact? And uh, you can clearly see it's still there. So, like, I think a lot of melee weapons are able to, um, you know, stay on there no matter what. Which is really confusing. Unless you melee, they won't stay on. So I think... Actually, I'm not sure. Okay, Swagger Stick is the next one. But you can test that out yourself. <laughs> I ain't no tutorial. <laughs> but okay. Now let's try the Swagger Stick. Same as usual. Sprint, melee, and jump. And as you can see, you have the Swagger Stick as you're shooting. And with the hammer, it's basically cheating because you have a really good iron sight from the hammer for some reason, which is really cool for like you know, spamming weapons to go like, you know, like that. Okay, does it disable when I switch? No, it does not. So for some reason, a lot of melee weapons do not disable when they switch. But I'm pretty sure a lot do, and you can see how this. Okay, what about throw? Nope. Interact? No, okay, okay. Okay, so, yeah, once you melee, I'm pretty sure that's when it goes away. Yep. I'm pretty sure that's for all of them. Mm hmm. So, yeah. No matter what, if like throwing or interacting doesn't work, I haven't tried tying up or anything like that, but I'm pretty sure it's just interacting. Um, I don't know. Okay, so let's go with the Nova Shank next. And I'm not going with the fists because I already showed you at the first, uh, at the beginning of the video, of course makes your weapon invisible. Just the weapon butt is the only we melee weapon that doesn't work, I think. And now you have the toothbrush looking thing as a gun. Let's try throw. Nope, just makes it reappear as you can see. It kind of looks cool, I like it. Okay, interacting. Oop, switching. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. Nope, switching. Nope. Okay, so the only thing that disables it is, of course, the melee. As you can see. Okay, so that was the toothbrush looking knife. And yeah, so the fists I've already done. So we've already covered that one, which makes your weapons invisible. Okay, let's go with 350k brass knuckles. And yes, I'm showing every melee weapon. I know it's really inconvenient, but it's worth doing a glitch video. And as you can see, it kind of helps you. Not really that much, because it's like, like two inches away from the actual shooting, as you can see. Not really good iron side, I guess you'd say. And for some reason, I'm holding one of the brass knuckles and the other one's just floating. Okay, throw? Nope. And it, of course, gets the thing back. Wait, am I still holding one? I cannot tell. But you can tell by pausing it or anything like that. And you can also, yes, you can do laser sighting. Nope. And switching does not disable it as you can see. I'm pretty sure for the brass knuckles though it cancels what you're carrying but yeah you can still see the brass knuckles are still there but I can't edit this. I'm just joking I don't even know how to edit because uh, yeah. Okay. This video is probably going to be an hour or two or three long. And I cannot show the DLC. I'm sorry. I'll show what melee weapons I cannot show. I should have done that at the starting. So, cannot show the scout's knife. Scout knife. This one. 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 And this one. But I'm pretty sure it works on those. It probably does. But I'm not sure. 
100% sure. Okay, now let's go with the Ursa Fanto knife. Okie dokie. As you can see, knife right there, floating. Grenade. Nope. Ma uh, you know what? I'm pretty sure grenade or medic or interacting does not disable it except for, um, wait. Yeah, no. So none, uh, everything besides meleeing disables it, as you can see. So I'm not going to test that out on any other melee weapons, but you can if you want. Because I'm not taking like 80 hours just to do this. <laughs> Sorry. It's, just that it's night time for me right now, and I don't want to waste my time. I don't waste my time, but you know, I got schedule to do. Not really. Okay, let's do the specialist knives. Okay. As you can see, this is actually kind of cheating. <laughs> Good little look, little look. Right there is exactly a tiny inch away. And plus, it's not really good in the dark, as you can see, because it kind of has a dark thing right there on the tippy thing. And of course, mailing disables it, but we're not going to do the medic bag and the grenade anymore. And yes, I'm doing this with the original weapons. I don't know where the- oh wait, oh, I was about to say, I don't know where the second one went, but look, it went into the weapon. Makes it look cooler a bit, I guess? I don't know. Where's the second one? Oh yeah, it's in the weapon, as you can see in the magazine. Right there. Okay. So yeah, we're not gonna do- try the interacting, or the, um, probably with the chainsaw, I don't think it'd work. I'm not sure though, because like the chainsaw is kind of like, looks really cool and stuff. Okay, let's go with the mother fork, er, <laughs> kind of a weird name, but yeah. kind of like a taser kind of for some reason. And it's not really cheating because it just looks like you <laughs> it just looks really weird. Okay let's do switch weapon. As you can see it is still there. Right there. Okay, I'll show you again. Right there. And of course the only thing that disables it, I'll prove it, is melee. We're gonna go with the spatula. This one might prove useful. But I recommend the hammer out of all of them, because the hammer is basically like the best um, iron sight you're gonna have. As you can see, I have the spatula now. It is not helping at all. Maybe for this, yeah, because you can like see the side and like like near the side where it's shooting. And reload with this tiny spatula. <laughs> of course melee is the only thing that disables it as I know of. Spatula. And no I'm not going to showcase this on every weapon. That'd be psychotic. And the C L A S shovel. This one might prove more useful because it's bigger. It's a bigger melee weapon. And no, I have to do this all live, which is really painful. And yes, this is kind of cheating. Actually, no, it's about like two inches again. As you can see. 
you can't clearly see it, but when I reload, you can see it. Oh, yes, you can. You can see, like, the side of it right there. It sucks that I can't just make a video and edit it all in, so you guys won't have to go through the pain of me just... It'd probably be way less, you know, time-wasting if I could just edit it. Okay, now let's do money bundle. The only reason I muted all my friends in the party that I'm in is so, you know, we can get this done. Plus, there wouldn't be any distractions or anything. Money bundle, as you can see, is not really useful. Actually, you can kind of see the tip of it kind of cheating right there after you shoot it. But yeah, mm hmm. Let's switch from weapons. Uh, you can clearly see the money bundle right there, or it's right there. It looks like demonetization. If there was a demonetization freaking melee, that'd look perfect. Just like, whoop. <laughs> yeah, you can clearly see it on this too. I don't know why, but I keep pushing options. Freaking finger stings because I cut a bit of my finger. Okay, I'm not sure about this one. Empty palm kata. Because, by the way, you're gonna need, you know, DLCs for the most of the stuff that I'm doing. Um, a lot of the stuff that I have for melee weapons. And no, they won't have the same electrical effect. The weapons won't. At least I don't think. Okay, empty palm kata. It's kind of like the fist, but, you know, it's karate. Or whatever it is. And I'll show proof that this is not edited. Oh my gosh, I'm going over here. There you go, that's enough proof. <laughs> okay, so, I'm just going to explain it again. So, sprint, melee, and jump. But don't push it at the same time. Okay, so it's basically the same. Is it the same? Except the pointer finger, for some reason, goes out when you reload. Let's see it when you switch, and like the fists, the, they do the same thing. But of course, yeah, since it's fists, or empty palm kata, or whatever you call it, it's probably kata, empty palm kata, but any fist thing, that's, you know, just fists, then it'll probably not work when you switch. Okay. Next is the bolt cutters. Also, this can be a reminder of what you bring. Like, if you do this glitch, it will be a reminder um, what melee weapon you bring to the fight, I guess. I don't know, if you don't have, like, poor memory or something like that. And this is just... Hold up. Boom. Yeah, so if you just focus, like, right in the middle, where you see that... Um, like a bit of gray thing that's standing out or not because you know when you not get in a certain spot it's not going to show that pew 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 and it reloads like this so all you need to focus on is like the middle between those two lines of course it's still here <laughs> it looks like a site that somebody just messed up just oh yeah look at the front of that thing <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh. And as you know, it stays on no matter what. I'm just going to show it one more time for anybody that's skipped here or anything like that, because I know a lot of people do. One thing that undoes it is the melee, of course. I'm not sure if it undoes it for every weapon, because I'm not doing that. <laughs> That'd just be way too psychotic. And no, I'm not sure if it does anything with a saw. Utility knife is next. This video is going to be so freaking long. <sighs> okay. Next is the utility knife. As you can see, this does not help out just like the fists. Unless you see that tiny, like, two milliseconds where it goes up when you shoot, 
and this is how it really loads. Oh my gosh, it looks so tiny. You see that? Tiny. Looks like a toy gun. But of course, it's a utility knife, you know, to cut off straps and stuff like that. Looks so tiny though. And switch weapons. And of course, it is still there, as you can see. Oh, that actually looks like it actually go with the weapon if it was orange or something like that. That looks so cool. Looks like a laser or like something that would come out in 2060 or something like that. I don't know, cyberpunk? <laughs> Okie dokie. Okay, next is a microphone. As you can see, this is it's like two inches away again, so it's not really that useful. The reload is like this. And of course it still stays on here, and that looks pretty cool if you ask me, if you don't look at the other, you know. Oh, it actually looks like it fits with it, like a talking walkie-talkie on the gun. And then it looks like this on this. Which just looks like a comedy gun that they would add to the game, like the comically large spoon that's only on PC. Which is really not that nice. But of course, you know, they can only add stupidly modded stuff and all that cool stuff on PC, like the suits. You can only have cool suits on PC. Okay, next is selfie stick. This one is going to be interesting since it's a long melee. You know, has some range to it. It's a lot of range, actually. Yeah. So it's like two inches away again, but like about one and a half inches away. And then of course it's still on here. It looks like a poop catcher or something or a bug catcher. Which is weird to say. Of course, that kinda just looks like well it kinda does help you aim down sights when you have like the left and a bit of the right line right there, it kind of helps. And it kind of helps shoot also, which is really cool. And here's the reload on this. And here's the reload on this. It just sucks that I have to do this live. I mean, not really, because every time I try to make a video and upload it from Share Factory, it just doesn't upload. Or it does, and it never tells me, so I have to upload it like three times by accident. Okay, next is bayonet knife. Then next is machete, I'm pretty sure, or something like that. Okay. So, it should really reload on that one. Then, I don't know why I have to show this, but yeah. Okay. Next is a machete, the one that looks curved a bit at the top. And yes, I am doing this on PS4, I should have said that. So it does help. If you don't look like at the curve, you just look at between where it goes light and dark, right in between there. Oh, wait a second. And that just kind of blocks it. <laughs> and it actually looks like it'd be like a melee or something. Broadcast my disconnect, so I might have to make a part two on this. I hope not. Because if I do, I'm going to have to be really pissed. <laughs> I know I didn't show the melee on the pistol, but I it's just hard, to, hard for my brain to, you know catch up with all this stuff. Next is the pen. This probably needs going to be another floating one or one that stays on the gun. It 
can even go full John Wick with the pen. <laughs> Okay, I forgot how to do it there for a second. So if you don't know how to do it again, so just run, sprint, and jump. So how fast every thumb can get to the X button, that's how fast you should probably do it. And don't try to do it like as fast as you can. Just don't do it sloppy, just kind of like in the medium, like just like this, just like. See, like once you see your melee weapon, that's when you should do it. Yeah, that's when you should jump, is when you see a, see your melee weapon. And not, like, mi mid-frame when you see your melee weapon like this. Not just full frame where you're like, okay, now I fully see it, now I'm a melee. <laughs> but yeah. Yeah, same thing. Doesn't really help out at all. Here's it on the AK. It kind of looks like it fits with it for some reason. Kind of looks like a melee thing for the pistol. Man, I'm not wasting time, but it's just feel time wasteful because, like, eh, I mean, not if other people can see how to do this, you know. Okay, for some reason it went all the way back to the weapon butt. I don't know why, but let's go with ice pick. Oh, it's because I went all the way back. Oh, fudge. You know what? It's fine. I have a pistol on this one too, right? I just noticed it's, it made me switch my build for no reason. Yeah, I have a pistol. This is kind of like an AK, just a bit more sight to it. Yeah, that's fine. I'll switch back to my other one now. Um, mmm. See, yeah, no. Well, I mean, it's because the optics, that's why it zooms in so far. Because this weapon has an optic. But this is a reload. Not really an AK golden AK but doesn't have a good reload to it. I'll just show you guys again. Mm -hmm. That looks weird. It looks like you could stab yourself whenever you try to shoot or something like that. Here it is on the golden AK. And I'm gonna switch back because for some stupid reason that got in my way and intervened. And no, I'm not gonna be like, okay, um, I'm, 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 just let me switch my melee and all this stuff. No. So next is the electrical brass knuckles. The electrical brass knuckles. So yeah, so you sprint, melee, and then push the jump button as fast as your thumb can get to the jump button. Um. Not useful at all. You can't you can't see where you're shooting. It looks like this is actually not the floating thing, but like it looks like it's actually supposed to be a weapon. Okay, the reload looks actually sincere. Like it's actually supposed to be a thing for some reason. Like look at this. Okay, and then for the AK, seems like um seems like the um you know the thing that I had as a pistol. It's right here as a wire on the gun, and then you can see the floating thing right there, and it automatically goes back down for no reason. Oh yeah, I noticed. Look at that charger thing input right there. That's at the back of the weapon. <laughs> so yeah, um, now this is the pistol with the thing, which actually looks, that actually looks, it looks like it's supposed to be a thing. That looks so cool. I would love that. Like, shock? I don't know. That'd be way too OP. Okay, next we have the telescopic bat baton, or B-A-T-O-N, as the next one, right? Yeah, okay. This video might be an hour too long, or maybe in between that, but I don't know. Okie dokie. So as you can see, this does help, kinda. Nope, it's still two inches away from where you're shooting. It's really not that good. Here's the reload on it. 
AK. That looks weird. And the pistol. Looks like another melee thing for the pistol or something like that. Or like a really long um, laser sighting that somebody just extended a bit too far and accidentally put it on the trigger. Okay, next we have the jackpot as a golden grin casino item. I'm not going to say that for all the DLCs, items. But you can see it because it says, you know, golden in the, on the golden text. So this is the jackpot. It looks weird, but if you kind of aim for the middle and go up a bit further, like almost to the red wire up there, you can see that it kind of helps you, but not at all, morally than a, the actual pistol would. Then here's the reload on it, which looks really weird. And on this one, you can kind of see it through like the uh, rectangle right there. Shoot and it actually moves with the weapon surprisingly as you can see if you look in the rectangle it actually moves with the weapon which is the first time I think and the reload on this you can kinda see the red thing but that's the only thing you can see besides the thing in the rectangle that moves around with it and that actually looks kinda cool but it kinda blocks your sight for other stuff a bit I don't know why you'd want this, but it's just funny. And yes, if you if you skip to like 30 minutes or like a bit higher, because I always do that and I know a lot of other people that do that. Um, so the only thing that cancels this melee w glitch out is, you know, mailing. And next we have the normal baseball bat. Not the uh, one with the blood and the... Um, fire uh, the, the fencing on it yet so that is pretty weird it's not useful at all I don't know why you'd want to do this just just for fun probably the, the reload it just it's one of those ones that stays on there but it actually moves with it surprisingly okay and then this um kind of so far as you can see right where you aim down the sights kind of has like a thing to it right there and then you can fully see it oh never mind that's just the sights but yeah you can only see it I guess when you reload looks like it actually is supposed to be a thing you can kind of see it if you aim all the way down or like close to all the way down and then for the pistol <laughs> I don't even know anymore Okay, it's not even clo that close to an hour yet, which is good. So that means I'm getting it done fast. Oh fudge, we got five and a half pages of this stuff. That's fine. Next we have uh, next we have the monkey wrench. This might be an hour or two, or three if I get unlucky enough. What I mean by unlucky enough is just that you know I have a bedtime and stuff like that. So sprint, melee, and then jump fast as your thumb can get to the X button once you melee and this actually helps out a lot as you can see it goes exactly where you want it to see boop and just a tiny tiny centimeter like where you don't want to shoot but that's fine because it's uh, that's only a tiny tiny centimeter then on this you can kind of see it on the bottom it doesn't move with a weapon at least I think and that just takes up the reloading animation, kinda. <laughs> like for this, it just looks like another melee weapon thing that the pistol should have, but shouldn't go through the gun. Or just like, should be placed somewhere else, I don't know. Next we have the classic baton, or B-A-T-O-N, but yeah, if you look at the golden text, that'll show you if it's DLC or not, because if it has golden text, that, then that means it's a uh, DLC item, I think.
run sprint and boom again this is not helpful and it looks really inappropriate but I promise YouTube this is a baton okay not something weird else you're thinking okay it's a baton as you can see it just looks weird when I aim it like this uh, it looks disgusting but yeah shoot 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 and it, it kinda has um, effect to the shoot yeah it actually it makes it better with the sh shoot like the without the aiming just shooting like this as this you can kinda see it through the rectangle that moves with it just not this type of wise actually I think it does but whatever and then as you can see it looks like an extended laser sight Did I forget to do uh, fudge. It's fine. I know people that watch this video have payday or are gonna get payday. One day at least. Probably. Next we have the hockey stick. As in, you know, the hockey sport, you know. Is your sight? right there and there it is and for the pistol it looks like it's literally reaching into even my sponsor <laughs> which is not of course because I don't sponsor hockey <laughs> I don't even know if that's a company or not hockey I don't know okay next we have the diving knife when I say the diving knife it's not named that it's just diving knife I'm just gonna say the diving knife though, just ignore the the, I guess, I don't know. So yeah, as this, it is like three freaking inches away from where you're actually shooting. Here's the reload. And for the AK, you can't see it, or maybe I can't. And the diving knife is right there as you can see in the reload animation, it's kinda hard to see though sharp thing that's pointing out of there. And then for the pistol, looks like another melee thing. Looks like it's actually supposed to be there, except it's on the trigger. <laughs> okay. Next we have the El Vergato. Wait, no. The El Ver... Dugo, whatever you call it. I'm just going to call it the El Verdugo. I'm not sure if it's racist or anything. But yeah, the El Verdugo. I'm just going to name it that. The El Verdugo. I'm not sure if that's how you say it or not. I don't know. But it just looks like a machete to me. But I'm not sure if it's like... Okay. So for this, that helps out a lot. A lot. Because if you look at the end of it, you can clearly see where you're aiming. And there's no like, you know distractions, but there probably w will be once you switch to the pistol, once you switch to the AK. You can kind of see it. And then here it is. As you can clearly see. And then it's kind of going through my hand, but that's fine. And then that just looks like if you use a weapon butt, it would add more damage or knockdown, I'm guessing. I don't know. <laughs> it looks like that. It doesn't, though. Next we have the hackathon, or just hack and then a ton, or ton, hackathon or hackathon. However you say it. Okay, 40 minutes into the broadcast, not too bad for almost three pages, I think. Okay, as you can see. This does not help at all because you can clearly see. See? It's like two or three centimeters above of where I actually shoot. And for some reason, it has a floating tip to it. You see that? A little floating tip for some reason. Not sure if that's actually supposed to be there or not. And then here it is. Yeah, that looks weird. Oh, it just detaches the top of it. Huh. That's weird that it does that. See, it detaches like the end of it at the top. Well, 
that's weird. I'm pretty sure this never happened to any of the Mew weapon glitches we've been doing so far. And yes, this is really, really, really hard to master. Like, super hard to master. Oh gosh, we're only on page 3, that's fine, that's fine. Next we have the Krager Blade. And next we have the Shield, which I'm pretty sure I already shown you guys in a video, but that's fine, I'll show it again. Pretty sure it's one right now, but I'll check right after this vid video. And it's just another, fl another floating thing. Yeah, it's just gonna be another floating thing. It just disappears. <laughs> then for this. Okay. Actually, if I hit one and equip the melee weapon, I'm gonna go do something. I think I'm gonna go check the time. Okay, I'm twenty-nine minutes left. Just horrible. I did not wanna do this video this late, but you gotta get some content in one day, or like sometime. Okay, this is the shield. Which kind of blocks your shield of view when you have a certain time of reloading. And then for the AK, it's just like this. <laughs> looks like I'm blocking. That actually looks... Like it's supposed to be there, like, you know, you're blocking while you're reloading, which is cool. I have like 28 minutes left, which sucks. So I hope I can get the video done fast. If I can't, I'll make a part two tomorrow. Okay, guys? Okay. <laughs> but yeah, if, I, if it's my bedtime, by the time I get this done, you know what, I'll still stay up a bit later. Okay. Okay, kind of useful. You just kind of have to, I, I don't know, it kind of really blocks your line of sight. And at first you can kind of see it. It actually looks really cool with the AK. And for the pistol. Looks like another melee thing for the pistol if it didn't just like go so long and touch the trigger. Okay. Yeah, fudge. Yeah, I promise I'll make a part two about this glitch. Next we have the metal detector. Yeah, so... Actually, you know what, I'm gonna stay up a bit later. Which seems illegal, but no, I'm joking. <laughs> I'm just joking, mate. So for this, yeah. Yeah, that's like one centimeter away about. I don't I, When I say this, I don't even know what I'm talking about. Oh, that actually looks really good with the AK. Of course, oh, that actually fits with it a lot. It's just that they need to remove the back of it, you know, just to make it have a taser sign or something. I don't know. Next we have the Croupier's Rake, or something like that. The Croupier's Rake, or the Croupier's Rake, I don't know. Okay, so this is the Croupier's Rake with the, you know, it actually is useful, just the millisecond when you shoot it, you know, it's, you can see it goes off a bit. Here's the reload. And then you can kind of see it there. And eh, looks like a pooper scoop rubber. <laughs> For the pistol, looks like a neither. Actually, yeah, it looks like a pooper scoop rubber on a weapon. <laughs> okay, it's been two minutes and I've gone through how many melee weapons? I mean, no, like 43 to. Okay, technically three minutes. 
Okay, I've gotten through only five. Oh, fudge. Next is the compact hatchet. Oh, did everybody leave? Okay, almost everybody. I'm still in the party with some people. Okay. So, yeah, this is what the melee thing looks like. And it does help out. It's just a tiny centimeter away. You can't see it there, but you can see it here, of course. And then the reload. You can kind of see it there. And that looks like it kind of fits with it if it was a bit more darker. And again, not touching the trigger. <laughs> yeah. Next is the potato masher. And I feel lonely. <laughs> Only because I muted my friends that are in the party just to do this video. You know what, give me a second. I know this is inconvenient, but I gotta do it real quick. It might make my mic louder, but that's fine. Okay, now I'm gonna do something again. Hello, you guys. Hi. So I'm not done with the video yet, but my broadcast can't hear you, so yeah. So this does not help. Just one, two centimeters away. What the heck are you listening to? <laughs> What the heck? Are you listening to memes, my boy? Uh, Scalper Tomahawk is next. Okay, does not work or help. My mind, you just listening to memes. <laughs> Okay, memes have gone too far. Eh, there's not three. There's a lot more. Switchblade? Uh, sure. Oh, gosh. No intro. It does not help. Okay. Hmm. What the? Next is the overkill boxing gloves. It does help a bit. What the heck? Oh, well that didn't scare me. <laughs> okay, next is the dragon's cleaver knife. 
What the heck are you listening to? <laughs> That's not even music anymore. Okay, helpful. Very helpful. What the heck? Next is leather slap. No, I don't think I know a kid song. <laughs> mm, a bit useful. No, over there. Next is the sh um, you know, Raphael's basically weapons in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, not sponsored. <laughs> these things. Not useful at all. Eh, not useful. Of course. <laughs> eh, that looks cool. Next is the Arcanus toothpick. I'm pretty sure that's supposed to be a joke because that's basically a knife, I think. Yeah, that's a knife. Yeah, that's a good song. And now it's just another floating thing. Another floating. Hey, uh, dude, microphone stand is next. Um, I gotta bear it back in a second. Beer be. Okay, you guys, I, um, you know, muted him and me so we can get this done with. But, um, this is the last one. I mean, not the last one, but, like, you know, that's what I'm gonna do. Kinda looks like a crossbow. If you get the right angle of it. But, um, yep. That looks cool. 
happened in this? What the heck? That was weird. Okay, you guys, you know what? So, um, we are going to be doing... Oh, wait, I just noticed you guys could probably hear him that whole entire time. I hope I spoke loud enough. I'm, I'm gonna check on this video after, um, I'm done with it, you know. But, um, so tomorrow, we're gonna finish this page, and then, you know, all the way down to here, since I don't have this stuff, you know, all this DLC stuff, so tomorrow I'm gonna make a part two on this, and I'm gonna go all the way, I'm getting all of it, you know, all the way to page five to the fire axe, because that's my last melee weapon that I have. Uh, you guys could probably hear him that whole entire time. Fudge. I thought if I muted him on, on PS4 that, you know, it would mute him on the broadcast, but then I forgot it doesn't. I gotta go to the audio share settings. Darn it. Like for half that broadcast, you could probably hear me, but I mean, you probably couldn't hear me, but that's fine. You could see the thing, anyways. But, um, yeah, so we're gonna stop here, and we'll, I'm gonna finish part, I mean, page four and page five, all the way down to here, since you know I don't have the DLC stuff. I'll see you guys, uh, tomorrow on part two on this. Goodbye, or good night, or good day, I don't know, but yeah, goodbye.